Hi everybody, welcome to this week's vlog. Um, boy, what a, what a week it's been, and, and then some. Uh, for the first time in a long time, in, in, in a couple of years, I am actually really, really behind on things because of the hurricane and everything that's going on. Uh, this week was very, very busy trying to get the repairs uh, situated for the house so we can at least live here and then um, trying to find contractors, uh, having adjusters come out. It's been a very busy week, but if you notice, we've kept a lot of content going, just no live content. Um, I took uh, an afternoon I had to wait for an adjuster and I filmed a bunch of stuff in the meantime. So I kinda keep, keep things going with content, which is really important is to make sure that we have content. And uh, there's a lot of things that I, I did that I really enjoyed that I did. Um, first of all, a, a new segment that I'm doing is uh, what came out from Miniature Market this week. It's going to be a weekly thing, and it's going to be more about every single thing that comes out and talking about it and s saying what I like, what I don't like. Um, the last one I just did, the first one, was kind of from September 1st. I just picked out a couple things that caught my eye. Some some people that are now part of, uh, are distributing to a uh, miniature market, which, um, you know, I'm just happy for them because I helped arrange it in a lot of ways. Um, you know, just making the introductions and stuff like that. And th those are some of the things that I really feel that I'm very good at. At, at providing a service for my my fantastic sponsor who are just absolutely fantastic the main problem here is that I am behind okay and I'm about three weeks behind um, the whole building up to the hurricane the whole um, uh, the, 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 the seven days without power which uh, really set us back a lot and then, of course, this week with all the the trying to make adjustments and trying to get things done, and we still we're still trying to put together some of the yard. Um, so you know we've been pretty busy with a lot of things. So um, for those that were legitimately concerned, thank you so much for your for your nice letters and stuff like that. And <laughs> well, you know, sometimes it's better to keep my mouth shut and, and what I, I, I think about a few things. Yes, I do eventually keep my mouth shut here and there. Um, but this is something that is very disturbing to me because I am somebody that always likes to be ahead of the game and kind of have, I'm very methodical on how I do things. So I'm behind on patron stuff. I'm behind on, on getting ready for all the paint jobs. Uh, to start and, and contacting people. There are a couple of things that got mixed up in the mail that I haven't taken care of yet. Um, there's a couple of things that I have to send out to people that I still haven't uh, had a chance to do. And I'm hoping in this coming week that I will be able to cut the time in half a little bit. Um, like I said, October is going to be a very busy and big month for me. And thankfully, uh, having Janice here is going to be a big plus because I'm going to be relying heavily on her because I know that she'll come through when I need something done. Um, so uh, she's going to be helping. Uh, I actually have Victoria who will be helping me with some spreadsheets and things like that to kind of just try to get back to where we're even keel and where we need to be. I assure you I'm a man of my word and that I take care of everything. I do. We, we have so many plans out here and next Sunday is a very big day uh, as Janice and Victoria are going to help me make the adjustments that this becomes the studio for the next six months and we'll be doing all our filming out here uh, at, from the end of October until probably May and you know in the area that I'm standing um, a lot of these shells are going to be uh, gone and um, you know, I'm going to be able to do my canvas stories. We're going to start with season one. I know I did a few of them, but I'd like to do season one and probably maybe have six or eight episodes total. I really love the oil paint, so I really love to do that. Uh, we're going to be setting up the table over in the middle here, and that is where uh, we are going to be playing a majority of our games and finally getting out some of the terrain that we want to get out and show you some of the 
of the games that we want to sh uh, show. Uh, new shelving is being put in. The games are being uh, trimmed down. We're going to have a shelf that we are actually going to have that has to be painted. We're going to have a shelf that is going to be uh, has to be reviewed and then we're going to have our own personal collection uh, by the middle of October we plan on uh, doing the second auction um, which was very successful uh, a lot of hang-ups with that but I'm gonna really rely on them to help me out with that and we're going to we're going to just keep on doing the things that we're going to be doing you're gonna see a lot of uh, where I take a subject it may be whatever comes to my head. Like this week, five games that I think are the easiest for beginner painters to do. Well, that was kind of a top five. But we just may take a subject and talk about it and not have to number anything. Or maybe there's a top 15 of something, or there's a top 10 or a top 20, or maybe we just talk about a subject. You're gonna see that segment every single week here. Um, Starting this week, we'll be back with our live plays. We're going to try to fit them in. Uh, we're actually going to be back with some painting videos. Some are going to be live. Some are not going to be live. Uh, we're trying to get a lot of stuff where we need to be. And um, like I said, it's a lot of work. And if, you know, I didn't have adjusters, people the, that are doing repairs, on top of having to work a full-time job and other things that you know this isn't a video to go oh hey I'm sorry but this that and the other this is hey you know we're, we're giving you the time we're going to make sure that we get to where we need to be and uh, we're gonna make up a lot of time so um, you, you know it's 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 never easy after something like this and you know then again we're also praying that we can make it to the end of October without another storm coming through October is a very active month uh, down here in Florida and uh, you know weather's changing we hope we can maybe next year get blessed and not get hit with anything uh, that'll give us time to what we were planning on doing was moving and when I say moving we're moving to a bigger house um, uh, we've, we've had our sights on a few things and uh, we like to move where I have a complete studio and we'll build a studio. Right now uh, the plants that we have I think are going to be very successful and help us and make us a little bit more professional but you're not going to lose the feel that, that you have. Uh, there'll still be games played on the kitchen table. Uh, you got to remember uh, we've got Christmas tree coming time coming up so I'm actually filming where we keep the Christmas tree. <laughs> So uh, I definitely have to get moving on some of these things. This week is Huracan, okay, and uh, we're going to be doing some coverage from there. Uh, uh, I will be there. I believe Janice will be coming with me, if I'm not not 100 percent sure. Uh, I think she said you wanted to come, so we'll be taking little Janice and see what her first thoughts are of yes, Huracan. The next week after that is Crucible. Um, it's another convention. Um, I may go there for one day. I saw something about it. Sam mentioned something about it. And I investigated a little bit. It might be good to get some footage from there and talk to some people, um, especially about some Games Workshop stuff. So that might be fun. We might be able to squeeze that in. Um, we are planning on doing Vikings at some point this week, uh, Battle Stations, and a couple other live things. And then the following week we are going to be, we should have Massive Darkness painted. We'll start working on Fate of the Gods. And of course, then, uh, what is the other game there? Oh God, uh, the Affliction game. I'm going to tell you in a minute. Just to show you. Folklore. And I'm going to teach Janice how to play uh, Too Many Bones. So I think that's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, we'll keep going with that. Um, you're going to see um, just uh, a lot, a lot more quick hit videos, but also, um, you know, we're going to get back to the heart and you know the meat and potatoes of this channel, which is the live stuff where you get to interact with the community and ourselves. Um, so I've got a lot of things planned. Um, uh, you're going to see some flames of war that I'm going to be working on. Uh, I'm going to be building some paper buildings, which uh, I need to get done. I'm also going to be painting some Blood Rage I need to get done. I am going to be doing a lot of things in the next two weeks.
to really catch up to where I need to be. Um, I know I've got my boy Pete. I've got to finish up a couple of more figures. I started on some things that I found um, that I am going to get and send out the Clan Wars to him. Uh, we're going to be looking at some older games too. I'm going to be breaking down some things. We're going to be looking at some terrain. We have a lot of fun stuff planned for you guys. I hope you enjoy it. Board games, painting, terrain, miniature games. We cover it here. We take care of it here. Uh, I want to thank everybody for their support. We are coming into where um, uh, the first of the year I'm going to be announcing what we are going to be doing with the patron and some, some of the things that we plan on doing. Um, I think you guys are going to be very excited about what I have planned uh, in the second year for you guys. Um, especially since uh, a majority of people at the end of October and November is a big month uh, come, come to their full term. Uh, you'll be getting emails from me, like I said, somewhere in the middle of October. I know it's two weeks behind, but it's better than the three weeks behind that I am at. So I, I feel that this week will be a big catch-up week. Um, I believe that we'll be able to, to compile two weeks into one. And if I can do that over the next three weeks, I think we'll by, by the second week of October, third week of October, we'll be all caught up to where we need to be. So it's going to take some elbow grease. It's going to take some patience uh, from... From you the wonderful community that we have and uh, I think what you're gonna see is it's, it's gonna pay off it's really gonna pay off for the community as a whole um, I believe it's gonna pay off for the channel as a whole uh, some of the very slight changes that we're gonna make are going to pay off uh, and the most important thing is people seem to like what we're doing now and we will keep on giving you a hundred percent of what we're doing we will give you everything that we got we'll leave it on the table like I said we will give everything that we have and we will give you the supreme effort that's what you deserve that's who you are you're a wonderful community and I want to thank you during this very difficult time the majority of you that have been very very supportive and kind and um, I can't thank a majority of you enough for your kind words, your support. I want to send a very special thank you to uh, Sean Mikowski for my birthday present. I thought it was the coolest thing. You will see them. I have a video kind of figured out for them. So uh, uh, they're going to make their way into something. So I think you guys will enjoy that. Um, <clears throat> there's a lot I got to catch up with and it's I wanted to make this quick video. I hope you liked the video earlier with the miniature market thing. Again, that is not how it's going to be every week. I think you're going to enjoy how the format's going to be going forward. It's going to be a little bit more professional. That was kind of rushed. I just kind of wanted to see how I projected and how I felt about it. I kind of liked it, and I said, yeah, I can, I can, I can put some work into this and, and, and really go all out. All right. I think I talked enough. This is going to probably be one of the shortest vlogs ever, but that's okay because, after all, we have a lot of catching up to do. So you have to shorten certain things and get, you know, get our elbows dirty and uh, get back to work and get some things done. Uh, you'll see a video every day this week, guys. Thanks so much for everything that you do. Uh, we'll see you when we go live very soon. Uh, it's sooner than you think, and. Uh, just thanks for supporting the channel. Thanks for being a big part of the channel. Thanks for all your comments, your emails. Those are another thing that I'm trying to catch up with. And um, thank you guys for just making this what it is. I promise you that I will just continue to strive to make it better each and every week. And I can only do it with your support. Thank you. I hope you guys have a wonderful, perfect Sunday. I know I will. Until next time, I'm Rob Warren. We will see you soon.